Hi, this is Josh Shanley with Capital City Investments and Income for Life. Uh, this is one in a series of short videos we're putting together of frequently asked questions that we get from investors of all uh, levels. And uh, today is more for the beginning investor. And that question is, what challenges does a beginning investor face? And so we'll just take a couple minutes to answer that question. Uh, primarily, there's two challenges that a beginning investor faces. The first is overcoming the fear of getting started. Um, that's pretty much, you know, par for the course in any endeavor. There's a fear of getting started, a fear of, you know, what, what is this going to be like? What's going to happen? Um, is this going to work? Isn't it going to work? Um, and I think um, most beginning investors realize that real estate investing is a path to true wealth, but they're afraid of making the first investment and, and what will happen with that. And uh, there's no real trick to getting over that. It's just simply to get started. You got to start somewhere, get started, get the ball rolling. Um, you'll learn, you'll grow, and you'll, you'll become a better investor by getting started and doing something. And uh, another point there is everything has a way of working itself out. The second challenge um, is, uh, has, is in understanding the proper investment strategy for his or her personal situation. Many beginning investors believe that they should be buying and flipping homes. And to be successful doing that, a beginning investor needs to spend on average 40 to 50 hours a week with this strategy. And I know this seems overwhelming and I know it's, it's, you know, um, uh, you know, there's all these TV shows now that flip this house type stuff, and, and that seems great and the way to go, but really, um, it's not the best way to get started. Um, that's for the full timers who are doing that um, as their primary occupation, um, not for those beginning. Um, the time investment includes looking for properties, making repairs, and managing contractors. And unfortunately, beginning investors still have full-time job and don't have the luxury of be being a full-time investor. Because of this, they're unable to get started and give up after a few months of effort. Um, beginning investors should follow a strategy that actually works and can be implemented in their spare time. And that's exactly what we provide to the clients that we work with. We provide uh, minimal um, uh, properties that require minimal time and, uh, and effort on the part of our investor. Uh, and we do most of the legwork for them. There's still work that needs to be done, but we get the ball rolling um, and we put things together. So if uh, you'd like to request a free report that will outline um, the core, sort of our core strategy and give you some details uh, and some great information, Go to the website at the bottom of the page, www.quitworkharrisburg.com, www.quitworkharrisburg.com. And we're just going to uh, finish up with a um, just a quick testimonial. Uh, this is from Dave Barrow. And uh, it says, in February, I bought a home with the Income for Life team's help. I just sold the same home to my tenant for a profit of $23,000. In addition to this profit on the sale, I made $200 each month in extra positive cash flow. That's just one of mem many members that uh, Income for Life um, has helped throughout uh, Pennsylvania and throughout the country. Again, uh, to get a free report um, that will explain in better detail, um, you can visit www.quitworkharrisburg.com. Thanks for taking a couple minutes to listen to this video, and I wish you all the best on your investing journey.